the problem is. That what I've just said is not some academic question. It's a real life problem. The Arab birth rate is enormous. Enormous. They have many, many more babies than Jews. The Arabs have babies, the Jews abortions. My body, my mind. 30,000 Jewish abortions a year in Israel. The Arabs have babies. Why not? We pay for every baby born in Israel. So the Arab parent gets, for every baby, baby born, every month a check until the child is 18. You think that we are normal? We need a national couch. <laughs> there was an, an article in the paper last year, a glowing article, a glowing article about a Bedouin Arab in Israel, a citizen of Israel, one of our Arabs, which means that he's, of course, loyal. Father of 48 children, six wives, 48 children. Every month he goes to Beersheba to the uh, post office, and every month he gets 48 checks and laughs all the way home. <laughs> and I read that, and I cry all the way home. What normal people subsidizes its own national suicide? We do, because we're not normal. So they have babies, and we don't, and there's no aliyah. What are they? What are, Who's going on Aliyah? Who's going on Aliyah? The Zionists in this country to do their Zionizing out of 515 Park, Park Avenue. Aliyah. Who's going on, on, on Aliyah? Hello. Excuse me a second, sir. This is not the United Knesset, so I'm, I'm, I'm now speaking and not you. <laughs> Tell me everything when your time comes, you raise your hand and I'll, and I'll call on you. Till then, they came to hear me speak. Now, there's no aliyah. It's a joke. It's it, it is a sad thing. I sit on the I sat on the 